All right, for the landmine workout today, it's a 16 minute AMRAP, so it's a little bit longer, okay? Um, not very many reps in each of the movements, so you're gonna be moving through quite a few rounds, okay? So, uh, scale early on this one, and make sure that you do something that you can do a bunch of reps on um, when it comes to your push-ups and your thrusters and your lunges, okay? So the first movement is a push-up. Um, so I can use a surface, I can use a counter, I can use a table, um, I've got a chair slash bench here. Put my hands out about a forearm's distance apart from each other. I'm gonna go all the way down, pressing all the way back up, keeping everything in a straight line, okay? We wanna be pressing here from the shoulder, from the chest, not up here from the shoulders, okay? And we wanna keep the elbows in nice and close to the body. Um, if I'm gonna be doing push-ups on the ground and do that same concept, I can either have my knees on the ground, pulling my feet up towards the hips, Going all the way down, I can do a full push-up. Same thing, we wanna keep the body in a straight line. All the way down, all the way up. We don't want to hinge at the hips either way. We don't wanna snake, we don't wanna just move our upper body, okay? Um, you can also lay on the ground and either use your dumbbells or weights or whatever you've got. I've got my bag of books here. So I can do a push-up like this, using my books or my whatever I've got pressing, keeping the forearms straight, okay? So you've got six of those, and then you've got eight thrusters, okay? A um, couple of different options depending on what you've got for equipment. If I use um, my duffel bag or my backpack, I'm just gonna hold on to it, I'm gonna squat all the way down, press at the top, okay? We get to the top, I wanna make sure that our ears Everything is right over our center of gravity. It's not in front of us. It's not behind us, okay? Wanna end up straight up overhead. Um, I have a kettlebell at home, so I could do that same thing just using the kettlebell. I'm gonna hold on to it at the bottom just to give myself a little bit more grip, okay? I could do squat, press at the top, okay? So whatever you've got, doesn't have to be heavy, doesn't have to be anything. Um, just going through that movement. And then we've got a weighted lunge. So if I was using, using the kettlebell, I could hold it however I wanted to. I could keep it in that same position here. I could do my lunges as such. I could hold it on my shoulder. I could hold it down by my side. Doesn't really matter how you hold it. You're just holding something, okay? Um, same thing with backpack, book bag, whatever. I could put it on my shoulders. Um, I could hold it in front of me. Doesn't matter, you're just doing eight. So every time you step is considered one rep for a lunges, okay? So you'll do most likely six on each side. You've got 12 lunges total. Um, I would alternate those if I was you, okay? All right, same as usual. Let me know if you have any questions on equipment. You want me to look at your form, um, any, anything you might have. Just let me know. You can text, email, message, all that good stuff. All right? All right, have fun.